A vigil today calling for justice in the death of a three-year-old. Marcus Hayslip was killed last week in Kansas City as bullets pierced his family's car. 41 Action News reporter Brian Abel joins us. And Brian, his killer is still on the run tonight. Yeah, that's right. Ad Hoc Group Against Crime organized this vigil today, and they say it's about more than asking for tips or for whoever killed Ian Marcus to come forward. It's also a chance for a hurting family to learn how to heal from those that know that pain the most. Just eight days ago, a shooting claimed the life of three-year-old Marcus Haslip. Today at Loose Park, a vigil in his memory. Spider-Man was one of his favorite characters. Family and friends in mourning, asking for help to bring little Marcus's killer to justice. There's someone that is still out there uh, roaming our streets, and our streets would never be safe if people remain silent. Surrounded with support, messages to Marcus's mother on how to handle her unthinkable grief by those that know it best. I'm here, mother to mother, to let you know that I want to be here for you because I know how it is to lose a child and it's hard. I was seriously on my knees screaming, I can't do this. And a 21 year old boy, my son, put his hand on my back and said, yes, mom, you can. Yes, mama, you can and you will and you will have justice. Organizer Damon Daniel hoping young Marcus's vigil is the last one this year for a young child killed senselessly in Kansas City. And we've had right now 40, 43 homicides in Kansas City, Missouri, and there's about 36 percent or a little bit more than 36 percent are young people under the age of 24. That is troubling to me. And with such an unexpected tragedy, Ad Hoc is seeking donations to help with funeral costs. We'll have a link up on KSHB.com. Dia.